Tango on the transmitter, Buckle Box 137, 44 Union Avenue, Meeker Avenue, 2 Constantly 8th Street, by the first floor of the three story brick, 30 by 50. Second along transitor, Brooklyn Box 137. But he has his 44 Union Avenue, Constantly 8th Street, by the first floor of a three story brick, 30 by 50. Vision 11, at Box 137, address 484 Union Avenue, we use it all hands to fire. On the first floor of a three-story mixed occupancy, we have two-line stretch, one in operation. Primary search is underway. Trucks are opening up. We have water on the fire. At this time, three ten point five no codes have been removed from the premises. We will remain without the full whole case. All right, Temple Division 1-1. One, that recorded 5.59 hours. Duration of your incident is 1-8-18 minutes. Division 1-1, one, one, has a command channel been established? 1-1, one, one, folks, command channel has been Established by primaries on the first, second floor. Three-story, a complete negative at this time, Okay, 10-4, that's what you want. Do you have any special instructions for the satellite? Third alarm fire, uh, mixed occupancy, started in restaurants, spreading upwards. Uh, three line stretch, three in operation. Let me look around, see if there's anything to see back here. Nothing to see back here. Let me see if this is open. Yeah, they got heavy fire in there. Um, I gotta find a roof. Let me find a roof on the other side. 
Heavy fire in the back there. Heavy fire in the cock uh, wall. The Alright, they're gonna have to go to fourth alarm for this probably in order to contain it. Uh see where the angle is gonna be. Let me see if I can find something in the back. trying to do the best they can. They got fire in the back and in their cock log. Off the roof, they got heavy fire. Everybody off the roof, everybody down. Everybody off the roof, everybody down. came back here, that's where the fire is. Uh, there's no other angle. Right now. 
Assets, they're getting a handle on it, but uh, they still have a decent amount of fire in there. They're getting a handle on it. Three five eight seven. Three five seven. Out. 
I saw there's no real angle. I got a division one. One four six one four six one six one six. I got a division one. That's a good one. That's a good one. That's a good one.
guys. Uh, it looks like they're getting a good handle on it. It's a little sketchy in the beginning there. Uh, fire hides in these old buildings and these walls and these ceilings and these uh, tight areas. And good call on the chiefs to escalate the alarms as quickly as they did. In the process, people. Looking for extension right now. Possible extension at the second floor. They still have possible extension. Please send a place to the command. uh they have another fire going on 13 minutes away from here but we're just gonna stay here at this at this point with the one side we're opening up right now. Light smoke condition in the uh, second floor. Uh, it's a very warm morning. It's about 77 or 75 degrees early this morning. So it's going to be a rough day today. Um. I tried getting the best angles possible, but there was none, so... I thought they were going to stretch a line in there, they didn't. That's why I went and I got my little footage for you guys. Uh, smoke is lightening up. Uh, they continue to open up and check for further extension and small pockets of fire. Very light smoke pushing all visible fire knocked down. Uh, I think they got four or five lines stretched. I'm not sure, entirely sure if it's four in operation or all five. Look at all the lines.
primary is negative throughout. We've got secondary is on the uh, second floor negative. Uh, second of the 5-7 on the top floor with secondary. Uh, primary is the negative on the third floor. We have a small pocket of fire in front between the two buildings. We just took out a beam wall and we're trying to hit it. This is the third floor. We got two buildings in the front. Fire sector command. Come on, this is my sector. No, I don't know. Secondary is all negative. We're in fire right now on a second, uh, on a second floor. It looks like a hit you for the fourth out of the Alright, they're going to do a uh, progress report. Shortly. Second floor is negative. They're tearing it up inside, yeah. The walls, the ceilings, the plaster, the wood. Make sure they get it all. Feel calm. Alright, there you heard it yourself guys. We're gonna monitor for a little longer. They're doing extensive overhauling. I said five line stretch, they got four line stretch, but it looks like there's a few more on the ground down there, but I'll just leave it at that. I'll leave it to the pros to let us know how many lines are in operation. Uh, we're gonna monitor for a little longer. Uh, got no sleep, been running around all night. It's very warm early in the morning. July 1st, Friday, and they haven't even started with the fireworks yet, so I'm gonna monitor this for a little longer and then we're gonna be out of here. All right, guys, here we go. Where the rack at? There the rack at, rack one. Operating. Not yet. So that means there's another rack around here. There's one rack. There that rack at. Rack one. So that means the other rack has got to be close by. I'll look for it. But we're going to wind this down like I said. We'll check out some of the drone operations. I can't see the drone myself with my... to the naked eye, but... Oh, it's way over there. I don't know if they're gonna bring it down. It's way far from here. If they bring it down, I'll check it out. 44 Union Avenue, Meek and Acosta, 8th Street. 
That's for a flight of three story brick thirty by fifty. This uh, fourth alarm has been transmitted by the box 137, 44 Union Avenue, Leak at the the A Street. Flies a three story brick, 30 by 50. Yeah, they just transmitted a fourth alarm. Um, I'm almost certain it's for relief purposes uh, due to the extreme heat that's going on so early on in the morning. Uh, a lot of these members were working really hard to knock this down. But don't quote me on that, but I suspect it's for relief purposes. They have a lot of personnel on hand here already, so... <clears throat> Just showing you what's going on there, the rack at. Where the other rack at? There's the rack at, rack two. That's all set up and ready to go. So they got two rack on scene. There the rack on. Rack two. Rack one is over there. They'll set up. This one's got the fan blowing. It blows out mist. The members stand in front of there and they cool off and whatnot. Get a little bit of mist on them. <laughs> and then they get the electrolytes over there. <laughs> Copy the gun on 137 box the fourth alarm. Report Union and Metropolitan Stage. Engine 239. Engine 239, Alright, everybody's happy that uh, the rack is here serving some refreshments and uh, spinning some cool air. So, we're going to monitor it a little longer, wait and see. But it's pretty much done right now. We gotta do some more overhauling and such. And uh, the fourth alarm units will start coming in shortly and rotating and relieving the members. I gotta get some sleep. Two Charlie responding to the fourth alarm. Temple card two two Charlie. Uh, it's July the 1st, I think I, July the 1st, I think I said that already, very warm, uh, there's going to be fireworks tonight, tomorrow, Sunday, so it's going to be crazy out here, that probably will hold us for another fire that's going on somewhere else. Trying to get the drone coming down. There he comes. What they do is they bring it down. They change the battery and then they send it right up.
Right, Most of the fourth alarm units are already here. Um, they still continue opening up. They still have small, small pockets of charring and very little fire. Um, there's two other simultaneous fires going on in Brooklyn at the same time. So that's three fires going on. We stayed here. This was the biggest one. Uh, they're working on one of them right now and the second one is almost under control so um we're gonna monitor this for a little longer but most likely i won't be back with another video because there's not really a lot of operations left they're starting to um release companies and rotate members uh and such yeah, i think we're pretty good up here they look pretty good. So with that said, uh, from Greenpoint, Brooklyn, on a very warm July 1st, 2022, 77 degrees in the morning, high of 95. We're going to fly building the three-story 305 brick McDonald's with extension. Found a small pocket fire. They're investigating it inside this last building here. I'm gonna monitor it. Good smoke right now. The chief just went in. They're gonna check it out. Right on one two eight for five seconds. Five seconds. Chief, we're in three four in the truck. We're going to go to the post fourth side. A couple of hot spots. Uh, and just watching it down now. Pretty good to get that. All right, ten four. Five seconds of command, did you get that transmission? Five seconds <laughs> Come in, 
Barring anything major, I won't be back. I already said bye once. They're gonna check it out. Stretching more lines into the, into the back of this whole building here. They're stretching some lines in here in the back of this building and we'll see what happens. Examining all the corners, all the holes, all the walls, all the windows, everything. units are coming in they're winding down operations in that building over there and like I said they're inspecting this building here for a small pocket of fire possible extension they stretch the line to the back they charged it and uh, yeah uh, they placed this fire under control. They resolved the matter that was going on in this building. 
with that little line over there they had a little extension they knocked it down they're rotating the units overhauling uh, and doing some washdowns still washdown going on with that said two and two we're gonna see you all on the other side Thank you for coming on that fire